Happening, y'all. Welcome on back. So the uh, the last stream, I forgot I had a setting that was clicked off. Um, so the video is like seven hours long, even though past five and a half hours there's nothing. I think YouTube will fix that and just chop the video at uh, at five thirty. But if it doesn't, that's why. It's because we had wrapped up the stream. YouTube just didn't receive anything for it. Uh, you know, nothing, nothing being encoded. Uh, either way, though, we're back. We're back, and we are pushing towards the end of New Game Plus Plus. So, for those that are wondering what exactly that means, basically means that we're getting into kind of spoiler territory here. This is the third playthrough of the game. You're going to be seeing stuff you won't see on the first two playthroughs, and we're about to get started with Chapter 4. But with that being said, I mean, if you click this, I think you know what you're in for. Let's go. So we got to jump down into the depths. The depths. Who do I want to use for the depths? This is a pretty easy mission. Let's pull Ibis out. Oh no, don't overwrite him. Just in case something changes. This mission is all about patience. And smart use of the platforms. series and wondering how to hold the controller. Any suggestions? Alright. So one, I think back buttons help a lot. If you have a controller that has back buttons, that helps. The best thing you're going to do is just a regular grip and then use your fingers to tap your shoulders like this. Because otherwise you're playing like this and that just feels fucking awkward. So what I found the best is if I was shooting, I was tapping to hit my missiles out. But Having a back button so that you can boost is super preferable. Did you find an access point? Good job sniffing that out. Um, I will be getting S rank. As for a 100% walkthrough, it's not really needed for this kind of game. Because you can freely replay missions as much as you want. There is no uh, missing content. That's one of the big things behind the 100% walkthrough on the Souls games, is typically you don't go back. Whereas this, it's all about going back and replaying and doing missions over and over and over again. Am 
gonna try just dropping and dodging. I've never done this before. Yeah, no, that's that's not good. That's not good. We're just gonna do the the normal way. Every drop. Platinum is skill based in this game, so it's it's honestly hard to do a platinum guide. I mean platinum is also skill based in Sekiro, but no new messages. The thing is, so platinum the hardest part of platinum by far is going to be S rank on missions. And getting an S rank on missions that just comes down to pilot ability. That's it. Pilot ability is the only thing that matters. So at the end of the day, you know, a guide isn't necessarily going to make you a better pilot. Here comes the follow up 621. Depth two. This one's actually kind of a long mission and kind of a, a cold steel type mission. So let's pull him out. I would put it uh, comparable to other FromSoft games. You already have people on Steam crying that they want a refund because they can't beat the first boss. So yeah, pretty standard FromSoft. Rank is determined by time, damage taken, and ammunition costs. They are all important factors. So how fast you do it, how flawlessly you do it, and as little ammo as possible. Sawa and the Moonlight are both dope, yes. Dead. Oh, what? He recovered it.
You're a zippy one, aren't you? Down you go. Wazoo, big man. Of a build you've possibly put together, uh, it'll be up tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning, I'll have this exact build up on the channel. Basically, just a giant ASAC. With a big gun. Stop with that shit, holy god. No, he went above me.
shit! No, I'm dead. Oh my god, I'm not. No, I am. Damn it. Thing hits so hard. I need some bigger oomph. Some more oomph. Ow, you bitch. Most builds benefit from at least one energy weapon. I think it, it just comes down to your preference. You... I mean, an energy weapon can be useful. In other cases, it might not be. It just depends what you're looking for. I personally... I tend to... Uh, I, I have borderline... I, I would almost describe it as a bad habit... of gravitating towards groupings of weapons. I very rarely have a diverse loadout. I'll talk about that in a, in a second here. Um, let's see. Registration number RB20. Oh, do we have another thing? Sorry, Raven. It's just me. I wanted to let you know that some strange new data has been added to the arena's integration program. Why don't we go and have a look? All right, this is going to be another like kind of spoiler since it's a discount version of the boss. Uh, but looking at my ACs, I mean double Gatlings. Double melee, double pistols. This one's pretty varied. This one's varied. Uh, double pulse blasters. All lasers. All bubbles. All missiles. All lasers. All thunder. Pistols and double cannons. This one's actually varied. All sorts of explosive stuff. Double gats, double missiles. All lasers. I don't know, just something about the, the symmetry of having like double lasers or double rockets or whatever the case is. I tend to do that a lot. Uh, but let's see. The final arena battle. Classified subject. What is this? AC data that Ayer discovered in the integration program appears to be a sample that all mine was testing. Raven, I was looking for a follow-up to mine Gamma, but I couldn't find anything here. I did find something else. A vast horde of prototypes built with Institute parts. I haven't fought this before. Let's see what it's capable of. Is that a coral weapon? I want it. Oh god, you hurt so bad. It's the arena though. I just need to get a bead on you and... Come on, charge, 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 charge. I whiffed it. I whiffed it. I whiffed it. I'm bad. Wait, nope. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, man. All 
All right. If I didn't whiff, I think I would have had it. Main system activating combat mode. Oh, that's big. Ow, stop. What? You just ran up and kicked me. Covers too fast for me to use the pile bunker. Damn. I think I can pull this off with one change. Pile bunker, I love it, but it's too slow. Double the unga. Yeah, she's doing some mean fucking stagger, all right. Bunga bunga! Free fire shield! Throw the stagger! Ah. Oh, that was a fight! Fuck. It did look like a Coral Moonlight. 608 AP left. Thank you, Raven. That's definitely a Coral Moonlight. Learned a lot. Master of Arena cleared all arena programs. The Coral Rifle, NB Redshift. The ML Redshift, it's Coral Moonlight. Echo, Iron Data, Emblem Acquired. Well, 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 well. Goddamn right it was. There's something I realized when I was playing the role of pilot. Humanity assumed its current form to fight itself. To choose from infinite selections. That is the essence of the human race. And the key to biological evolution. Perhaps it is also a clue to what All Might's true goal is. Let's take a look. Okay, so compared to that, the redshift has better attack power, slightly less impact, better cumulative impact, better blast radius. Heat buildup is significantly higher though. The charge shots aren't gonna be as strong. The charged cumulative impact and the heat management is better. Direct hit adjustment is higher, effective range is longer. Charged ammo consumption is lower, ammunition cost is cheaper. Interesting. So I think it's it's very similar to the other one. It just it becomes coral. That little multi explosion is fucking sick. I like this thing a lot, but this is mm, fucking sexy. Quick shots, it's better for quick shots. If I'm charging, that's a whole different charge. This is better for charge shots, so we're gonna give that the Coral Rifle, and then uh, the ML Redshift. Manipulates Coral Swarm Intelligence using energy to accompany slash charge to increase output, produce larger waves. So compared to the Moonlight, it is more attack power, more impact, more cumulative impact, better direct hit adjustment, better PA interference, but it's weaker charged. I never use the charged attack on the Moonlight. This is an absolute win. 
It's just a straight upgrade for Ibis. Fuck yeah, dude. What's the charge attack look like? Same. Red Moonlight. This, this is badass, because now I have the red laser, I have the red moonlight. All I need are to replace my orbits with something red. God, it's such a sexy bot. Back to work, 621. Depth 3 is next. Bang out Depth 3, on to Act 5. We're coming up on the boss of, of uh, Chapter 4, which is really hard. Activating combat mode. Commence mission. Destroy the reactor and disable the laser barrier. How many hours? Over 90. Watch your footing. You don't want to fall into those lasers. Hostile threat detected. Threat level 8. Defense phase 4.0. Terminating target. This area is the best snipers. Don't let them shoot you down. This is interesting. This is actually like... This is really good for this build. Because this is all about non. Like, charge attacks were my weakness with the other build, because, you know, it's leaving me stationary. And this is just a non charge attack variant of the same build I had, which is just completely better in every regard. The sword does, uh, overheats pretty quick on it. Find the pressure chamber, 621. Destroy it. The resulting overload will cause the reactor core to explode. I do a damage test on it after this. This is part of the inspiration for Ibis. Now you know where I got the ephemera name from. I want the chasers that it has for my build, though. I wonder what the button, what's the button for, uh... 
Odo mode. Oh, V. Uh oh, I think I I think I crashed the game fucking around with photo mode. <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> oh, well. <clears throat> this vape is straw melon apple. Photo mode, photo mode, photo mode, photo mode, photo mode, photo mode. Hope y'all are ready for all the red again. We're gonna go faster. The thing is, when you're playing, uh, when you're going S ranks, you're going to be replaying through missions anyway. Watch your footing. Don't to those lasers. So it's just escape and V. You fall into those lasers, it's bad news, bears chat. Scenario unlocks, we destroy an enemy AC and gain access to it. Uh, I mean, you don't immediately get their parts, but anytime you beat something in Arena, it'll show up in your AC data as a selection. They're just fucking spamming all of its heels, you little shit. Wait, what though? That's one use of terminal armor. 
I popped that thing's armor and it was like, shit! I gotta heal the fuck up! Now that, that's a cool photo. That was a close one. Man, that AC rips through everything because your boy knows what he's doing. Trying to skip the dialogue so y'all can get all that on your own. Except for the shit I haven't experienced. I'm doing all that. No new messages. Alright, we're coming up on one of the hardest bosses. Raven. Maybe. You've got two requests to go with the order from Archibus. One is from the Liberation Front. Oh, well, there's a new mission I'm doing. should consider what your choice means, Raven. For my part, I've chosen to trust in you. Whatever you decide. This is where the, uh, shit really matters. Intercept the red guns, ambush the vespers, eliminate... I think this, I think this one's new to me. Let me make sure. Red Guns and Vespers. I've done both of those. Eliminate V3. This request comes from All Might. True to form, they've sent us an encrypted message with top level security. I expect it must be about Coral release. Coral! Augmented Human C4621. Raven. There is an obstacle to the project that must be removed. The target is V3 O'Keefe, an Archibus Special Intelligence Officer. I don't think I fought this guy yet. A second generation augmented human, O'Keefe was once our ally within the corporations. But it seems he has had a last minute change of heart and means to betray us. You are to ambush the target during his Archibus ordered survey of depth three. His records will note death by misadventure. The release project must succeed. Only an exceptional augmented human can be the key. C4621, Raven. Allmind is certain of your success. If this is just going to be a fight. Main system activating combat mode. I mean, she's seen my performance. Commence mission. Oh, I 
left. Guess it's just an assassination. I wonder. A key to coal release? We've completed all mine's request. We can go now, Raven. Man, the charging bunker hits are so fucking good. They do so much damage, just boom. I love I love how when you get it with like the final hit, just boom, that like beefy ass. Just drop. Oh, shit sounds so good. One new message. Augmented human C4621. Raven. The project is nearing fruition. We will meet again when you reach the Coral Convergence. I think I'll have a new boss on Coral Convergence. Unknown territory survey. Real fast, is there any, uh... No. Okay. This is a quick one. I have not tried the new Lords of the Fallen. Power bunker or beam saver? Oh man, I'm all about the power bunker. Actually, if you set your Xbox to New Zealand, it comes out now. Closer. Closer. Rusty. Go deal with a mercenary who went in alone, they said. <laughs> Figures. Seems both of us are too dangerous to keep around. And the higher ups wouldn't miss an opportunity to kill two birds with one stone.
I mean, the ultra lightweight ACs can work. They're just, they're squishy. Look at Rusty. Rusty is an ultra lightweight, and look how much damage I hit him for. Personally, I don't really, I don't play ultralights. Because you need to be fast as fuck to use ultralights. And the type of player I am, I like getting up in the body of stuff a little more. The city. So I don't, I, I go, the lightest I have, uh, well, ephemera is pretty light, but it's like fast and staggers. I see them so clearly. The voices of the core. And then, um, My family. I guess silver streaker is pretty light as well. Sisters consumed by the fires of Ibis. Only a few survived. But after all this time... They finally formed a new flock. It looks like Walter has sent you a message. Let's take a look, Raven. And the thing is, ultra lightweights are just, they're, they're very high skill ceiling. Because the thing is, you're sacrificing defense to be incredibly fast and evasive. And so if you make a mistake... If you make a mistake as a lightweight, you get obliterated. Like a big, a big fucking. Oh, this mission, fuck me. Uh, I'm gonna start with this, and then I'll probably have to change it out. Actually, no. Let's uh, let's change it out now. The lightweights get the job done. There's a specific build that I use for this boss. Which I should, uh, let me actually save this. I haven't actually beat this boss with mouse and keyboard yet. It's it's hyper fucking evasive. Every time I fight it, I need to rely on um, I need to to pull out hard lock. But I do have a lot more time with mouse and keyboard now, so we'll see what happens. Cowboy Blast! This is one of the most terrifying variants of my builds. Just because it stays directly on top of the fucking target. It stays right on top of him with the gats. Right in the sweet spot, and then it unleashes double cannons. Switching to encoded channels. This is new. Augmented human C4621, Raven. V2 Snail intends to dispose of you once your utility is spent. Proceed blindly and you will find yourself a prisoner of the corporations. 
We will transmit his coordinates. Fuck yes. Oh, uh, I hate Snail. Snail's such a douchebag. Fighting the boss that I thought we were gonna fight. That's the independent mercenary. Something's up. Are we being jammed? The signals. Is there any loot hidden down here? This is so fucking dope. Now I'm coming for you. Both ACs were destroyed, but all is proceeding as planned. Yes, it's a force. That's what the independent mercenary is for. Just checking for loots. Douchebag. Kill your ass too. The cowboy blast raid and supreme. Steel 2 OP. No new messages. We've received a message from All Mind. It sounds like they want to bring you under their protection as part of the Coral Release Project. Hell yeah! Let's hear them out. That's nice. I, that way I don't have to spoil that boss, because that's a cool fucking boss. What was I about to do? That's what I was thinking about. Could you... No, you could not. I mean, the direct hit adjustment is just so high. I guess the fact that I'm using two of them. I think that's what makes them so strong. That direct hit adjustment on them is pretty fucking insane. This direct hit adjustment is not bad. Or something that's a little bit faster. MIA. Watchpoint Alpha Depth 2. Augmented 
contacted human C4621, Raven. The project is nearing fruition, thanks in no small part to your cooperation. During the battle for Institute City, several of the corporation's key pilots died in combat. We have manipulated the data to state that you too were killed in action. However, you will not be truly safe until you formally accept our protection. C4621, Raven. Return from Watch Point Alpha Depth 2 and head for the rendezvous point. That is all. Watch Point Depth 2. Let's keep, let's keep with the... I want better scanning. I mean, this one's so goofy. This one has good distance, but poor duration. The hall's not bad. God, it looks does not look does not match. I could rock the Melander C three. That one's not too bad. Let's do that. Once you reach oh. the rendezvous point, no one will be able to threaten you anymore. Sounds a little ominous. All right, before we do this, the wife needs me to put Dorian down in bed, so give me like a minute here. I'm going to go downstairs, move the boy to his bed, and then we will, uh, brand new mission. Oh man. Oh man. What's the difference? New game, new game plus. A bunch of missions I've never seen before. And a whole ass different outcome to the story. Dude, all mine is spoopy. I'm not gonna make it.
Man, this thing fucking gobbles up energy. Definitely needs a different Jenny. Is this huge bad end vibes? No. Holy shit. Fuck. I don't even know if I would describe this as the bad ending. This just feels like the AI takes over everything ending. This is so fucking cool to me. to fight. happening. Your safety is now guaranteed. What the fuck is happening, dude? We have entered satellite orbit. Release the subject from stasis. Understood, Master Allmind. Activating cerebral coral control device. Augmented human C4621 has awakened. What the fuck is happening? Raven, you've come too. No brainwave abnormalities. Thank goodness. Deepest apologies, Raven. It was for the best that you remained asleep until the situation had settled. Allow us to explain. You are in the vicinity of a closure satellite in the Xylem's hold. As anticipated, the corporations have siphoned the coral into a single mass. Coral. All that remains is to seize the opportunity to set the coral free. So that it may carry humanity toward new horizons. 
coral release is imminent. Raven. Air. You shall be the trigger for the change to come. Bro, <laughs> this ending is going wild. Human C4621 entering standard mode. No new messages. Raven, we've received a request for Moment. We've chosen Coral Release to pursue humanity and Coral's potential. Now that the choice is made, we have to carry on. No matter what obstacles confront us. That head just looks so weird on this body. Okay, no additional battle logs, so we're set there. We gain control of the asylum. Destroy all parasite modules set by the overseer. remains. We are now beginning the purge of Overseer, the Association of Observers. They are planning to crash the xylem into the vascular plant and ignite the coral. We want you to stop the ship from within. Destroy all the parasite modules installed throughout the xylem's control center. By doing so, you will free control of the Xylem from Overseer's meddling, allowing All Mind to counterhack the system and initiate a forced shutdown. Sixty six with the same customization, more. We have precious little time. Once the Xylem passes the point of no return, a collision will be unavoidable. All Mind anticipates your swift success. Capacity is just whack on that. <laughs> Four second recharge delay. Faster quick boost, boost speed. Seeing streamers are new to this franchise crying nonstop. It's hilarious. They be it good. The problem is they're convincing the chat not to buy it. Most people sound like idiots, so we just ignore them. Game is phenomenal. If you're an Armored Core fan, this game is like a fucking dream. Sharing progress on the battle outside. Your handler 
is a rather capable pilot. Walter, how's the starboard block looking? Six pilotless ACs, all exact copies of the Vespers. Yeah, same story over here. This is a bad joke. Three minutes until the Zylum's course can no longer be altered. We have little time to spare. Target destroyed. Three remaining. Fuck, fuck. Alright, listen. I'm trying to hurry, but I don't know where the fuck to go. Come on. Damn, that fucking recharge was long. Hello, hello. What do we have here? The IB C zero three W four. Light shoulder ammunition at fifty percent. That's a new weapon. That's a new shoulder weapon. That's one of the shoulder weapons I was missing. I wonder if the other one's in this level too. We're gonna have to do like a serious comb of it later. Ow, ow, ow. One repair kit remaining. 
Ow, 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 stop that. The fuck? God damn. Please be the last one. Damn. Got fucking close. Like, uncomfortably close. Coral shield. Augmented human, C4621, entering standard mode. There's a battle log in MIA that I didn't get. There's no battle log over in here. Let's go back to MIA. Harley, stop. Ow, ow. <laughs> we gotta find the battle log. All right, let's keep this set up. Let's go for mega goofy scan head. And then to offset that, we'll also go for the big thick boy chest. A lander C3, 128, we're looking good there. How many hours? I'm coming up on, uh, I'll be at 100 soon. I'm at 94 at the moment.
Somewhere around here is a target I have to kill. Do I spy with my little eye? Target to kill that's hiding down below. Nope, not here, huh? I figured it'd be here for sure. trying to figure out I, I put up a bunch of shorts like where to find certain weapons and for some reason YouTube's not classifying them as shorts looks like because they're over 60 seconds they're not considered shorts should buy this on PC. It's much better on PC. Back in here. Wait, we found a failing straggler. Damn you, Archibald. G6 Red.
done yet. Watch out. <laughs> you little bitch! Why, that's not, how's that my fault, bro? Look at that combat log. Sneaky asshole. Which head is the one they used in the first trailer? Yeah. Yeah, that's, um... What's his face? Nightwing. videos I was so I made I made some like short somewhere to find certain weapons but since they were over 60 seconds YouTube didn't process them as shorts it just kept them as a normal video which is fucking weird ooh coral oscillator what does that do obtained all combat logs let's go C4621, Raven. You have submitted all combat logs requested for the log hunt program. Are you the type of person who doesn't start work until just before the deadline? No matter. The important thing is that the work is done. Prototype Coral Shield developed long ago by Rubicon Research Institute. Application of energy interference creates a 360 degree defense. What the fuck? That's what he was using. Bro, you could probably juke people out into thinking you have a full on shield with that. Interesting.
Coral Oscillator. Prototype Coral Oscillator, developed long ago by Rubicon Research Institute, manipulates coral swarm intelligence using energy to create a blade-like beam. Charge the weapon to perform sweeping area attacks. Damn. That has some charge. Oh my god. Bro. <laughs> Bro. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. Wow. Oh man, oh man. We're going to do some uh, melee tests. Pulling up the Excel spreadsheet. I know how much y'all love numbers. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Don't I have them all now? Let me see. Oh, yeah, I do. Twelve, thirteen. I have found all melee weapons. Fuck yes. We got to test out that moonlight. And on our back, we got to test out Coral Oscillator. All right, let's see. Uh, moonlight. Coral Moonlight, Coral Oscillator. The AI off trench pad empty. Alright, so let me check the stream here. Stream quality. How hard did that hit? 2367 it looked like. That's weird. That is only 4734. But that's supposed to be stronger than regular moonlight. So how is that possible? Oh. Regular moonlight did 6681 in the same exact test I'm doing right now. Let me check something. Maybe something changed. Something definitely changed. Something definitely changed with the build. What did I change on this build? Weaker all of a sudden. How much was that? I need to fuck. Oh, let me go to playback speed and turn it to like point two five. See. I think it said 2064. Oh, 
something's wrong. Something's wrong. Why is this not hitting as hard as it used to? Moonlight shouldn't be. Something has changed. My head changed. Previously, Pile Bunker was hitting in the range of 10,000 on this guy. Let's see how hard that hit. struggling to catch up. I'm going to have to test numbers later, I think. Here we go. Nope, oh, 10. Hang on. I can barely make it out. It was 10,000 10, and some change. Ten, nine, four, eight. Oh, values have been changed. That's ten, three, ten, three, four, eight. Okay, so wait, that number is accurate. That number is accurate. Did did Moonlight get a fucking stealth nerf? Let me try. Let me hit something else. Let's go. Um. Let me try the laser dagger. That was like twenty four ninety nine times three. Seven, four, yeah, no, those numbers are accurate, huh? Something's being fucky. Could it be that Moonlight is affected by your Jenny then? Shouldn't be the case. So previously, Moonlight did 6681. Wow, that was only what, 20? Damn, that's, that's weak. That's really weak. They must have nerfed it. They must have. That looks like 2044. What the fuck? That's 4088. And then the coral moonlight was accurate. Wait, wait was it 22? It does. Twenty forty four. What the fuck? Hang on a second. Maybe it's my generator. I didn't think generator affected melee. That's doing one thousand forty six. No, same. 
So generator has no impact. Damn, they just they just nerfed it, I guess. Damn. Wait, that did 2357 right there. Fuck. Damage tests are so fun. Shotgun pop. Twenty three sixty seven by two. Yeah, forty seven thirty four. Moonlight got fucking Moonlight got stealth nerfed. Moonlight got stealth nerfed at some point. But now we can double the Moonlight to build! Let's see if I can beat 4734 with the charge. Regular Moonlight's number might have been from the charge. That looked like 50... What was that? 50, 52 and change? Fifty-two, thirty-four. God, fucking cats. What? Go away. Come on. Stop scratching. Fifty-two, thirty-four is the magic number, chat. Fifty two fifty two thirty four. Shit, what was Moonlight's old hit then? The number I had for Moonlight was supposed to have been charged. Ah, I fucking whiffed it. That just hit for 66.81? Fuck. Which was the original, I think, number I had on Moonlight. Let me see. Um, hang on, I think I actually gave these stats to Oro. Let me find the old one to see. 6681. Indeed it was. Okay. And so charged. 
hit. Charged. Laser lance. Charged. Laser blade. Charged. Pulse blade. Double hit. Laser dagger. Three X hit. Plasma thrower. Whip. Double hit. Charged. Shock accumulation. Charged. Moonlight charged. Stagger weapon. Charge combo, 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 charged, charged, charged. Okay. Sorry, chat. Just Making, I'm making a numbers sheet. Like I said, this game is all about Excel. Type charged regular moonlight is sixty six eighty one. Coral Oscillator. Does like a vertical slash, which is interesting. Is this only one hit? That's one hit or a charge hit, correct? No, it is one hit. Okay, so charge is the only thing to test with this. Did a lot of fucking damage, it looked like. Let's see how hard it hits. Charged equals C. That was a big fucking hit. It's kind of slow on the sweep, though. Six, nine, eight, nine. So it's just a giant hitbox that does six, nine, eight, nine. Very nice. I now have a list of all melee weapons. Beautiful. You see something? I don't think the charge throw matters for the explosive thrower. It does not.
And then it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 13. All 13 melee weapons have been found, chat. Um, let me give this to the good folks in the Discord. If y'all curious, the direct hit damage, chainsaw, 12,617, the twin blade combo, 11,320, pile bunker, 10,347, laser lance, 8,782, laser blade, 8,631, pulse blade, 8334 with a combo. Laser dagger, 7499 with a combo. Coral oscillator, 6989. Moonlight, 6681. Plasma thrower, 6789. Coral moonlight, 5234. Yeah, 52, Stumbaton, 4642. And lastly, the explosive thrower, which is for stagger, at 2236. One shot build or closest equivalent? Uh, that would be the uh, the cowboy blast. Do you want to see the cowboy blast? Do you want to see the cowboy blast against Freud? This is the rank one arena contender. This is, uh, I would consider this to be one of my strongest builds right now, and... Where'd you go? Come here. Ah, I fucked it up. Fucked up my combo. Main system. Activating combat mode. Come down. It definitely needs the direct hit to fit, see the full... It looks kind of better with the cowboy build because the pistols do a stuck shit ton of stagger. Evaluations. We thank you for your cooperation. Chat, what should I do with those half ass shorts? Do I just leave them? Do I redo them as proper videos? Do I try and make them into a short? I don't know. Food for thought. Final mission Coral Release. I'm going to be up against for the boss. The final stage is at hand. Together, we shall achieve coral release. Well, I mean, it's monetized either way. So the the, the problem. So, all right, let me just let me just Back do this. Of flamethrower is a very. Let me just do this. Let me share screen real fast. So. I made, I made some, I thought they were going to be shorts, so they look like this. Interesting weapon in AC6, whereas most weapons revolve around building up stagger to then do direct damage. It has the target. vertical thing, the but the problem is that 
because they go over a minute, YouTube doesn't classify them as shorts. And so they just get put into the video bucket instead of the short bucket. So people aren't going to find them if they're looking for shorts. So I can either try and redo them and make them under a minute. Or I should redo them as a proper video. I mean, they're getting views. It's just I feel weird because it's like not a video, but it is a video. I don't, I don't know. It's a short that's classified as a video. But if I redo as a short, some of them, <clears throat> like the helicopter boss video, I'd have to chop 27 seconds off. Most of them are like, a, they're between a minute and a minute and a half. But that's the problem. To make it an actual short, I need to get it under a minute. What is this? Look. The coral siphoned by the corporations is beginning to resonate. <laughs> Augmented human C4621. Raven, your role has come to an end. Is all mine gonna try and kill me? Well, well. I've been waiting for this freelancer. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? This time you will die. Is this is that Iguazu? Main system activating combat. What the hell? It's a Guazu! This is definitely a multi-phase. You are aberrations to the plan. Irregulars. What the fuck? bring order to chaos. What the fuck? Okay. Now it's time for the real boss. Is this a 2v1 final boss fight? Is Ayer coming to help me? Bro, the thing has some fucking beef. Let's do it. This thing, oh shit, it's got two spider sea weapons with it. Oh no, bro. Oh, 
gotta do a laser beam or something. Alright, one's down. Nope, stop. Get off my PP. I don't have time for you. I need to charge, 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 charge. Is it down? Where's it at? It's above me. Ah, it's above me. Ah, get off of me. Ah, get off of me. Ah, what are you doing? Oh, the whiff on the grenade! I need my shield. Mm. Is there a second phase starting? Nope, I don't have the fucking ammo for this, bro. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, what a fucking fight, bro. Ooh. Oh man. I think I can do it with the build I had originally. I think double stun needles can pull this off. I need to go back to one of my thick ass heads, this guy. I need a different generator. Dude, that's fuck. I might have to do the melee build here. Cowboy Blast 2 OP. fight two of them, I might have to just fucking take him down. Ah, 
We gotta use a lot of kicks. Hard enough. Stupid voices. It's all clear now. Nope. I feel good. Now it's just you and me. No. Fuck, so close, dude. see something real fast um Oh.
figure out what this is. I got an email. It doesn't make Give me one second, chat. I'll be right back. Let me see something. Um... All right, we're good. Yeah, so I randomly, I got an email that was like, you know, uh, review your credit. Your credit balance went up extremely high. And I'm like, what the fuck? And then it's like a credit balance change. You're you're currently at, uh, you know, blah, blah, blah. This, this card is almost at maximum usage. And I'm like, what? And then so I log into my card and it's not. I'm like, what the fuck? But what was weird, it was like, it was a credit alert from, no, it was, it was actually from, so my Chase account gave me a credit alert for my city account, but I logged into my city account and it's fucking fine. And I'm like, okay, shit don't make no sense. Um, I think we need, I think we have to run melee here. Where's the head? There it is, the Basho head. And then not the earshot, but the songbirds. And then not that Jenny, but this Jenny. And then not that booster, but this booster. And then maybe even fucking assault armor here.
system. Activating combat mode. Kyle Bunker says die. Yeah, because it, it tried saying I had like an $8,000 credit balance, and I'm like, what the fuck? And I pull up the credit card, and it's at like 2000 I'm like, yeah, these numbers are fucking whack. No, fuck, I'm not using them. Stop that, fuck. Look, get off of my pee-pee! He's just on my ass. I'm dead. Oh, fuck, dude, he's doing so much damage. This ghost of me won't last long. Leave a spot for me in hell. I was actually doing really well, and then I got all fucking distracted by that stupid bank shit. Alright, let me try. Let me try just bursting. Bursting the Guazu down. Oh, where's he at? Where's he at? Where's he at? Fucking, where's he at? You little shit. He's fucking so evasive. There we go.
have to. I have to use the shield. So I'm gonna. I have to kill the ads. That's the only way. Main system activating combat mode. Bitch. Oh, he got the shield up. That's how we get it. Oh! One down. God, get off of my PP! He's gonna do his thing. It's resonating. What are you? No fucking wombo combo, dude. Suck my dick, holy shit. Dude, this is what's wrong with the internet. Game hasn't even dropped yet, and you're pushing for the third ending. How are we supposed to get excited and enjoy anything these days? One, I have almost 100 hours played because I didn't play the game today. I've had it for a while. Two, suck my dick. Stop trying to, to fucking gatekeep how other people have fun. Three, once again, I have over 100 hours played. I absolutely am enjoying myself. And four, you clicked the fucking thing that said New Game Plus Plus pushing for the last ending. Think what we can do here. What we can possibly change up. Our arms will be overburdened with that. Arms are gonna be overburdened with that. My how I can change up my arms burden, I think. Which one is this one was not Oh, the two stage, the two stage on this, was it? Yeah, the two stage on this was the free fire beam, okay. 
Um, I'm gonna have to Melander. Okay, let's try this out. Main system activating combat mode. Yeah, adding a coral weapon to get through his shield helped out a ton. Get off of me! I need more heals! Get off of my dick! God, you do so much fucking laser damage. Oh, he fucking juked out of the way. Jesus. Bro, his melee attacks are so fucking strong. Let's bring out standard cold steel and just see what we can do. Main system, Maybe with the extra mobility I'll be good. Not with that start, I'm not. Fuck, dude.
I need to let Air do a lot of the work here, and I need to focus on just dodging his bullshit. Fuck! Get off of me, dude! These lasers! Holy shit! So if I push him, do they die automatically? They do. Damn, I couldn't get her off in time. Okay. So if I can push him down... If I can... If I can rush him down... It'll get rid of the two things. Main system activating God, he has the multi-energy rifle, he has everything that fucking hurts. Alright, we're looking good. Where's he at? Where's he at? Where's he at? Where's he at? There he is. Where's he at? Where's he at? Where's he at? Oh! Damn, bro, he just curves around and does whatever the fuck he wants. Stupid voices. 
No, I'm dead. I'm dead. Fuck! Alright. I didn't want to have to do this. But we're pulling out the controller. Reload! God damn! Alright. I'm waiting, I'm waiting on my, uh, my direct hit too much. Hardlock is gonna carry this fight though. He just moves, like, so, uh, for, there are three bosses that I have struggled to keep up with when I am playing uh, on mouse and keyboard. This is the third.
Jesus, look at his ass, straight up fucking teleporting. Yes, it was. Fucking final boss. The freelancer. Who had it all? Oh, man. What a fucking final fight, bro. That... That shit was intense! Humanity. Creation's potential. We have the trigger. And we'll pull it ourselves. game settings they're just they're just default except I think I have motion blur turned off and that's it it's like a big it's like a coral black hole Rusty. We're everywhere. Anywhere. No, it's not Rusty. It's a different head. Who is that? Raven. Let's meet this new age together. Main system. Activating combat mode. Fucking absolute banger of a game. Holy shit, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god. Bro. Oh my god. Stargazer cleared all missions. Alea 
Ikasta Est. Third ending. Holy shit. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Authentication complete. Removing MIA status. Restoring access privileges. This is All Mind, the mercenary Bro. support system. Oh my god. Stargazer, you've completed every mission. Emblem acquired. Alright, so, looking at Steam, let's look at my uh, trophies here. What am I missing, trophy-wise? Four hidden achievements. Obtained all parts. Obtained all weapon parts. Obtained all inner parts, and then clear all missions with an S ranking. So, I'm missing some inner components and some weapons. Inner components and weapons. Now, the tricky thing is that we have all of our battle logs, we have all of our check marks, we have all of the arena, well these arenas, I guess I have to get far enough to redo them again. That's interesting, you can't replay those. Uh, the problem, I don't know what fucking mission the parts are on, and that means the parts are hidden in a chest. Oh man, They're, the parts are hidden somewhere, and who fucking knows? So, going off of AC data, so I'm missing a rummy part, which is probably in an early level somewhere. I'm missing something from him. F ran Setsu Bootta P05 Act 2. Hang on, I'm gonna pull up a part list of shit I'm missing, and then we're gonna start hunting. We're gonna hunt. Institute Tech. Okay. So, let's see. Going off the first one. I have Tian King. Hang on a second. I'm going to put all these together. Have my part list complete for what I need to find. So he is King King Wrecker Wrecker and then King all the way around. Let's got the head. I know I got the chest because I use it all the fucking time. Tian King and Wrecker. 
Deion King, Wrecker, Deion King, and Wrecker. The Ephemera set and the IB set, I know I have. Ephemera. Oh no, what am I even looking at? I, I, I know for a fact I have all those. I have all frame parts. What I am missing is inner parts and weapons. So... Weapons. IB. CW3. Let me see here. So CO1W. I'm gonna... I'm gonna make little, uh... Make little arrows through stuff. So C, C O, C O one W one, C O three W, C O one W six, C O three W one. Got it. I'm missing whatever the C O three W two is. Let's look at the uh, certain coral weapons here. So the redshift moonlight and the other one was the redshift gun. MB redshift. W6 redshift. And W7 redshift. Yes, okay. So got redshifts done. Left arm unit. IB CO3 W2. So there's a second rifle I can get somewhere. IB NGI 006 and 028. Let's see if the shield is one of them. 028s I have. The IB right back unit. IB NGI 006. I don't have that, and I would guess it's the tracers. So there's a rifle. There's a rifle and some tracers that I'm missing. Alright. Uh, as for the booster, IBCO3B. I got that. And IACO1B gills, I got that. BC0600, 1234. <coughs> so there is a booster on the crappy mechs that I'm missing. The B. Let's see. So I need this. <sighs> now the hunt begins, chat. The IB... The BC... 0600123345. Uh, let's look at the FCS, the Abbott, and then the FCS G1P. I'm pretty sure I have both of those. Got it. Abbott, got it. Uh, generator. The DFGN Lintang. Got it. And then the AGJO. Got it. Okay. So I'm only missing a booster from them. NGI and then IA. IB, CO3B. That I got. That's for the FCS. IB, CO3F. I'm missing an FCS. The IA, C01F, Ocelus. And then as for the generators, IA and IB.
So I'm missing one institute weapon, one, one institute weapon, one institute FCS, and then a generator that's a crap part. Now we're going to do a quick Google search for this and see if anybody has found it. Yes, somebody found the ship part. BC. BC. What is this? On the large platform. Okay. Hold up. Let's see. Heckin' Honest Brute, really. There's three in this mission. You ready for this tourist? Large open platform, train tour table in the middle. Main system, activating combat mode. Alright, tourist. I'll tell you where to go. Welcome, tourist. It's a delight to enjoy the company of a visitor from so far away. It's over there. I thought I fucking explored that and found it. I've even come back here to kill these things before. Oh, it's right fucking there! How did I miss you? Look at you, just hiding there, waiting to be obtained. Get up! No! Get up! Assault boost attack? Are you talking about kicking or attacking while assault boost? Because you just double tap assault boost to kick after you've unlocked it. Otherwise, you just literally press the attack buttons while you're rushing in at something. Kill brute. There's your way in. Brute can't be far. We should keep an eye out for traps. They'll be much more dangerous in tight corners. Jump down there, and we've got him cornered. Don't forget, the guy's a rat. This won't be smooth sailing. It is kind of, kind of fitting that the final boss got beat by the cowboy build. Yes, you have to unlock an augment to use kick. Come on down, bro. What are you doing hanging out up there? Come on.
Oh man, you're fucking annoying, bro. Search for IB C03 W3. IB dash C03 W3. There's a website that has it listed, but with no fucking location. How useless. Um, let's see. I-A-C-O-1-F. Ocelus. No. Booster. So, I mean, well, I have nothing to spend money on at this point. I have everything. So, we are missing... Rifle and an FC or a back weapon. We're missing the tracers and we're missing the FCS. This mission was just a fight. I feel like there's something else here in regain control. We're going to put on the search head. And then we need some heavier firepower. Can I run double linears? Is that okay? Can I do that? Where my linears. EN shortfall and overburdened. I 
I guess we could just keep the pistol on. We need to find goodies. Yeah, we didn't really get to look that well. Well, 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 look what we found. The NGI 006. So all we're missing is an FCS. I wonder if the other one's here too. Three minutes until the silence course can no longer be altered. We have little time to spare. We might need to find them both and then do it just fast as fuck. Where I came from. Two minutes.
I shouldn't even be fighting. I should just be looking for the chest. Take some time and kind of just cruise around and scan now that the timer's up. Because I feel like it would be... I feel like it's in this mission. I don't know why, I just... I mean, we found one. Well, technically two. There's two chests here. Raven. No. Air. Not right now. We're busy looking for loot. chest at. Oh, where, oh, where can it be? I require to get my item. Oh, where, oh, where is it? See? Different mission, perhaps? I don't want to say, it's nice to know that the only thing I'm fucking missing now is an FCS. Like, I have all the weapons, I have all the parts. The last thing I'm missing is, like, a support-esque type item. thinking it's not on this mission, but I am thinking it's on one of my new missions. See, now I already know the gimmick here, though.
Yeah, it was way easier the second time. Chad is an AI. Laugh. The Xylem control system is silent. Augmented human C4621. Raven. Your efforts have averted a collision with the vascular plant. Oh. Additional. Handler Walter and Cinder Carla have been dealt with. All we're missing is an FCS. Coral Missile Launcher. Sounds so fucking sexy. Ibis. Parts by... Prototype Coral Missile Launcher developed long ago by the Rubicon Research Institute. Energy interference applied to swarm intelligence enables coral based tracking and detonation control charged to dramatically increase damage potential whoo look at the charge attack power fuck effective range 1000 <laughs> holy shit what is this what is this Well, I mean, God, I kind of have to put it on him. I, I wonder, I don't think we get the tracers. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Am I missing something else? Coral rockets. AC design data. Institute. No. I'm missing the Aurora, I believe. Those are tracers. Zero two eight zero zero six and the IA C zero one W three Aurora. I make notes. Okay. So I'm missing an FCS still. I don't have the Aurora. I have everything for you. The only difference between y'all is the Celius. Well, there's more than that, but... <sighs> Ocelus is necessary. And Aurora is necessary. Hmm. So, this is strictly just a fight. We found two chests on this one. We went back through. I feel like we scanned this one pretty well. So I don't think it's there. Bring down the Xylem. I don't think it's there. They need institute missions. Maybe destroy the drive block. I've only played that one once.
I brought the wrong fucking AC for this. I need I need my my AC with the scan. I mean I can just I'm gonna look fucking stupid, but that's all I need. I have I've only played this mission once, so I have a big feeling that one's gonna be in here. Jesus! Bro, I want to use those with the missile boat. And people are going to be like, what the fuck did he just hit me with? We're getting scans on people who are pretty fucking far away. The beam on that is disgusting. I think it goes farther than the regular moonlight. Yeah, they're far as fuck, and I'm scanning them.
all builds OP. Well, I mean, you see the kind of damage they're doing. I think in this case, the insane lock-on time is justified.
There's two Skirmian generators left. Once we've shut those down, we need to deal with the range energy. Destroy the generators and head outside. Sustaining major damage! We're dropping like flies out here! Target is 1 AC. Get the pain. I'm liking the the red moonlight a lot. It's pretty good. Don't let him get any closer. You're out of luck. There's only one person who can keep up with me. That's behind us. I don't have a lot of ammunition, but I'll tell you what, this thing would probably be fucking insane in PvP. Man, this level is always a clusterfuck to try and navigate. Regular missile kill these things. Let's see. Oh, fuck yeah, it fucking will. enemy, but I'm not seeing a chest. Yeah. 
Here come the missiles! No, he got me with the double wombo combo. Well, I think you know what we're going to pull out to beat the shit out of him. Do you want to get bullied? Balteus 2.0 because this is how you get bullied. This isn't the right build. I mean, it was the wrong build, so I kind of expected that. You should have on your good head. Where's your good head? There it was. And then you should have on double of those. And then, no, not that one. Not that generator. Should have on this generator. Though I wish I could have on that one. Mid range. And then this was our guy. Alright. Nah, build's fine, I just, I didn't have, that was the, like, the exploration version. You're below that. You are vermin. This is this is what I mean when I say I was I didn't have the right build. <laughs> yeah, like I said, <laughs> just the wrong build, just not not the uh, the stuff he's supposed to have. Which obviously quickly took that guy completely fucking out of the equation.
What's the most broken build? You're looking at it, buddy. Damn, A rank. And I spent a lot of time just wandering around that fucking level. That could have. I could have easily been an S rank if I wasn't, uh. wasn't fucking around. Ugh. Okay. Probably, what time is it? Midnight? I'll probably wrap up in a second. Let me see. Mm, no, it's just a battle. We did that. We found two there. Defend corporate forces. This is a long fucking level, but I don't remember seeing anything on there. Yeah, you get rewards for playing again. Yeah? Um, I mean, it's all it's all institute parts. I just want those last two parts, but I think I'm probably going to wrap up. I'll go to bed in a second. I'm happy now that we have, uh, this will be a joint operation with metal Flower, the liberation front commander. They're coming Raven. Whenever the moment is right. It's an ambush. What could this emergency call from V2 be about, sir? That's just snail being snail, my boy. Love to send it to me. Stop! Railbook! Bam! What's the matter? Superficial damage. No abnormality. Good. Open fire. <laughs> no. No abnormality, he says, as he is on the verge of death. Shields. Goodbye. V five Hawkins down. So it's not here. This mission's too short. There's a part of me that's like, find the last part, and the other part's like, no, I'll let somebody else find that shit. Easy S rank. Easy S rank. Yeah, I'm not sure. Fuck. So we got two out of this. We did a pretty good sweep of that. There's none there. We know it's not there. I want to say I did a really good sweep of this already. But maybe not.
put on my scan head. didn't have one but this is a big fucking level See, I feel like this this mission is just one big fucking battle, and a lot of times the big fucking battle ones don't have chests. Nothing on scans. This is actually a pretty hard fight. <clears throat> yeah, it ain't on this level. Chatty, come here. God damn, I hate this fucking mission. Fuck, Carla. Long 
Carlo, you were so fucking annoying, I swear to God. God damn it, her missiles fucking staggered me. On average, I need to get them to about 75% for an instant kill. Yeah, that ain't no S rank. That's a B, probably as low as I got. could have gotten an ass if I didn't get my cheeks clapped so hard. Either way, chat, I think this is a good spot to wrap. Um, so even though we beat three endings, obviously our armor core stream journey isn't done because I need to get S rank on every single mission to get my platinum, which is gonna be a fucking fight and then some. So I'm gonna go to bed for now. Uh... Possibly more Armored Core tomorrow. I mean, realistically, yes, probably more Armored Core tomorrow. Um, but I'm going to wrap up for now. Real fast before we do, let's see. Just I'm curious if there's any uh, open lobbies. Search. Oh, it's full. Fuck. I saw PvP and was like, what? Let me search again. Alright, no PvP tonight. Anyway, y'all have a good night, and I will catch y'all tomorrow.